Never been poor. Used to play Sims 4. Put a little wall around niggas. Hey, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Sha, and I'm back with another video. I'm back with Team Mom episode two. If y'all ain't get a chance to see the last video, I will put the video. Wait. <laughs> Yo, excuse me. I swear. Every time I start to record. But anyways, I will put the link in the description below from for the first episode. But y'all, 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 I'm talking to all my um all my all my subscribers that actually like you know, make let's plays and like, you know, make YouTube videos and stuff like that. I swear, do y'all ever like, like after y'all start recording, like after y'all like get done y'all recording or whatever, do y'all ever notice like, damn, I forgot to say this. I forgot to do this. I forgot to, you know, you be having stuff already mapped out. And then when you hit record, it's just like shit go out the window. Cause that's how I was feeling with the first episode. Like, oh my gosh, y'all, I forgot to even tell y'all sincere traits and like little shit like that like i'm just like ugh, i gotta do better but um i will be telling y'all a little bit more about sincere that i forgot you know um when we get back home because right now chanel is actually at school y'all know that she um don't go to online schooling no more it closed down so she has to go to school now this is her last year this is her senior year whatever so we got to finish off strong we're currently a f student so we definitely gotta um we definitely gotta finish all strong but um currently chanel is drinking her smoothie she's sitting next to somebody named greta she don't really know too many people at school only because it's a so boring look like chanel has not been getting along with a certain homebody sim homebodies homebodies are sims that prefer a quieter life they tend to enjoy calmer craft related hobbies rather than ruckus adventure seeking they might also be a bit more introverted than other sims some some sims just find this type of lifestyle boring in terms of sims preference would you would you say that chanel dislikes homebody sims i mean she say so boring so i get the vibe that she don't like homebody sims so i'm gonna just say yes she don't she dislikes homebody sims so wait it's a the Wayne and Kashmir now despise each other. What's going on over here? Oh, I guess they having like a, a little disagreement. But um, Chanel over here being nosy. She like, what happened? Like, what's going on over there? But um, Chanel actually got a crush on this boy named Scotty. Um, they are Twitter mutuals. It's a amazing comp compatibility. So it's a like two perfect pieces of a puzzle. These these sims just click based on their preference. They have the the highest level of comp compatibility. Building a strong relationship between these two sims should take much less effort than usual. And she perceived him as extremely attractive. And Chanel sentiments about Scotty. She's crushing on him, and he's also crushing on her. He's on the swim club and he's on the football team. So him and Kaz, you know, they they know each other. <laughs> but I thought that was interesting that you can see like, you know, different compatibilities and stuff like that. Look at her coming over here to be nosy. So it's a new popularity, new popularity status. Popularity during the high school years equivalents to social status. Being popular can open both admiration, jealousy, emulation and annoyance from peers while opening doors for more social opportunities and perks so let's say the sim is now a member of the social group artists collective sarah just became good friends with chanel i don't know who these people are but chanel need a dentist appointment and her eye exam i just put the mods back in my game since it was updated but right now it's free time for another 59 minutes she just wanted to come over here and be nosy. She's talking to Cash and she's talking to Scotty. But yeah, Chanel don't know too many people at school. Like, she don't get along with Casey only because Casey and Cash, um, she caught them flirting, caught them flirting or kissing, I think. And she don't know Cassandra. We would have, oh, we don't want to be best friends. We don't even know you. We don't mean to be mean, but... Y'all remember Greta, Greta the one who Cash, you know, went over her house and woohoo with or whatever. Freaking, I, I feel like, um, 
what's her name? Casey Med. She probably Med that Chanel's like in school because honestly, Chanel was homeschooled for a minute. So not homeschooled, but she was doing online school. So she wasn't really amongst everybody. So it's just like people probably like, what's she doing back here? Like they probably thought they would never see her face again. But it's time for first um period, and today is Friday. If y'all not familiar with the um. If you're not familiar with like how the class the class schedules go on Fridays, it is exam day. So we definitely gotta um pay attention and stuff like that. But I had her studying, so she is well prepared for um the exams today. Let's see who's in the class. Who we are who who are we wait, what? Who are we are we in class with so we got i forgot his name uh Dwayne. i think this is a new student we got c we, we kind of cool with c we got aaron i think that's scotty ish munir and that's a new student and then the other students are in the other class how she got an attitude probably like, i do not feel like this shit today like these kids get on my fucking nerves <laughs> All right, so we got 13 minutes. Look, all the kids is on their phones. Let's actually check our uh, Twitter before class start. See if we can make a status or whatever. So we can post about our new outfit. We, I, I guess it's like the new our, um, our uniform. So we're going to post like embarrassing because you know chanel like she's trying to be like a designer and stuff like that so she probably like nobody want to wear no uniforms dressing like everybody everybody looking the same so we just gonna post like an embarrassing narrative so let's say try something new and i'm regretting it now i'm regretting it now does this outfit look like i just face planted into a pile of clothes that's how she feel about the school uniform okay so I'm glad that I got my whims back because now I can actually like do what she want to do. So she want to meet someone new. She want to level up in her handiness skill because she's from being so clumsy. Um, She want to chat with other students from being at school. And I still want to figure out differences with other Sims. That's from being judged because I feel like when you, well, I know when you do that, um, this actually go away because she she had fear of being in crowded places and I had her do what they asked. What's this? They say, hey, I just be, I hey, I heard you became friends with Kevin McGee. He's pretty cool. What is Cash Mom calling us talking about? Chanel, what are you doing? Come sit down. Come take your look, y'all. She is doing too much. Come sit down. Girl, today is exam day, like, you better get it together. Can we not take the exam? Oh, my gosh, you know. We attending the exam, but she the only one that's not writing nothing down. Oh, my gosh. Girl, take your exam. What's going on with you? It say not my vibe. What is this awful look? Chanel can't stand basic fashion. She's feeling very confident, smooth talker, perfect pose, all the friends, hydrated, made a new made a new good friend. What are you about to do? Okay. Easy sippings, stylish choice, excellent style. Chanel's lo Chanel loves polish polished style. Um, grime time. What's the shared knowledge from being asked about woohoo? Wait, did that person just ask her about woohoo? And what you say? It's a Janelle might not be an expert in the subject, but at least she could answer a few questions about woohoo from a fellow student from a fellow team. It's better not to get information from suspicious rumors. And she got hydration on her mind. Okay, so hopefully, fingers crossed, y'all. Um. At least to, uh, I'm hoping that when she finish school today, she'll at least be like a, a D student at the least. So it's a, a difficult problem. If you had accident, if you if you had accidentally discovered the best flavor of bubble tea that you had ever had in your life, but it uses a petal from the death flower, how 
how would you convince other sims that is worth the taste rely on chemistry um skill or wing it i'm gonna rely on chemistry chemistry um skill okay so let's say chanel trusted in her understanding of the subject matter and felt that she gave a pretty good answer to the question large skill large skill based exam boost okay so we starting off to on a good on a good note y'all i like that it be pop-ups like that and we can answer the questions i really do enjoy that i wish it was like more so let's say chanel eyes are bothering her maybe something just in her eye or we got to schedule an eye exam and a, den uh, a dentist appointment she is dazed and confused why are you the only one on the floor Listen, let me not judge. That's probably how people, you know, how people prefer to take the uh, exam. So, it's lunchtime. Um, she want to chat with students. Let's actually chat with um, Cash because we got to talk to him because it's Friday. And at least, like, once a month, he do spend a weekend. Or, he, we, we, you know, we try to, like, set up an arrangement for him to come over and spend more time with his son. So, um, I'm going to actually, like add him into a group and maybe we can like come chat you know in private not amongst everybody so let's just come i was not expecting him to see, you know i wasn't i wasn't really expecting to see cash in school today because it's really like random who actually comes to the you know come to the school yes i wanted to talk to you over here so let me um do interest. Let's discuss interest. I am making us walk, you know, making us walk over here to talk to him. I mean like, hey, you um think you can come over this weekend to spend some more time with your son? Well, let's figure out differences with cash. I seen it, okay. Child, she probably annoyed that cash talking to Chanel. We having an awkward conversation. Y'all see how they romance, you know, it was way red, but it went down over time. So they're getting a little better. Let me see. Um open up their sim profile. So it say it's complicated. The burning romance desire cannot be quilled, even if they don't like each other that much. Um they're broken up. They're still Twitter mutuals. She perceives him as extremely attractive. It says Chanel sent him about cashmere. Um, she's still crushing on him. And it say comfortably compatible lifestyles. So it says Chanel found that sharing a lifestyle with cashmere only deepen only deepens the attraction that Chanel that Chanel feels. And it say cashmere sent him about Chanel. He's still deeply in love with her, y'all. Like he really still do love Chanel. That's crazy. Like, yeah, so you think you can come over this weekend? Um, I think this is a, a good weekend for you to come over and spend some time with your, um, you know, spend some time with your son. Oh, they about to flirt. I want to see, you know, I want to see how they are just, like, without me controlling them. I want to see if the love, like, is, is really still there. Because what y'all think? Y'all think that Chanel and Cash can, like, get back, you know, into a relationship or... We just got to see how, we got to just let nature's run its course. But he like, yeah, I think I can come over this weekend. I can stay until like Sunday. Um, so yeah, I'll just come over when we get out of school. I'll just let my parents know, you know, that I'm going to be over your place for the weekend. So yeah, I'll just talk to you later. I want to see if they're going to flirt or not, though. But I think she doing the whole figuring out differences. So we did it with one sim. I want to know, do they get like a cinnamon from that or something? I don't see nothing for that, but she did. Okay, wait, here we go. So it's a sorting out problem. Sometimes all it takes is a little open communication to discover why a sim might not appreciate another sims company so she did figure out her differences with cash and i and it went it went good so i feel like their relationship is only getting you know better 
So we just going just like ask about his day. And let me see if she like hungry or anything. She's not hungry. Can she like study for exams or anything? Alright, this is her locker. She can freshen up. She can buy a football. Or right, well, it's a be friendly with a faculty a faculty member. So let me see if she met, you know, officially met any of her teachers. You know, Daphne. Come talk to Miss Daphne. Deep thought. Let's share ideas. This girl. Oh, she introduces herself to Chanel. What's her name? Nina. Tali. Hey, Nina. Hi, hey, Miss Daphne. Here, let's buy your water. But she had hydration on her mind. I wanted to see if she can study, you know, if she can study in between the exams and stuff like that. So let's say Chanel is fully prepared for the next exam. All right, so we fully prepared, y'all. We just got to knock these out, like. I want her to, you know, get to know some more people while she's, well, you know, while she's at school. Because she want to meet someone new. We was over there talking to, to Nina. Let me actually have her do, like, a friendly introduction. Because I felt like she was trying to introduce herself. We got Cassandra, Cassandra Goff over here. Like, hey, wait, yo, why do this boy keep, he wanted to be our best friend. Now he asking us to prom, like, you doing too much, bro. What the hell? I'm sorry, in here, new student, but like, I'm sorry. I'm not interested. And it's like, we, we real good friends with him too. Let me just try to like, get to know her, so. Let's discuss interests. <laughs> Are you okay, girl? Why are you so dazed? <laughs> this shit, like, you really gotta go to each different category. Oh, it's time for class, y'all. I'll be moving by so quick. I slowed down my time, but it still moved by so fast. <laughs> but, like, we won't be getting enough, getting, getting enough time to do everything. <laughs> but... I'm really loving, like, this whole going to school. Oh, wait. Let me see who's in this room. We got... Look at Zora. Zora over here. We got Casey, Greta, Julius, Kalani, Kevin, uh, Kayor? I think I named Kayor. Kevin. Wait. I say like Kevin. Oh, wait. It's two Kevins. And Cassandra. So where you at, Chanel? Oh, now y'all sitting, sitting next to each other? Before you were sitting behind them. Plain slick girl. Huh? Y'all had that little conversation. Y'all figured out differences. Now, now y'all sitting next to each other. That's cute. All right, so we got 26 minutes. Can we post something on Twitter? Like something that just like recently happened? So we can post about finals. Post let's post about lunch because we just came from lunch. So let's post. Um, we got the, we got an uncomfortable narrative, stress, mean, happy, ener energized, embarrassing, or friendly. I mean, lunch was okay. We figured out our differences with Cash. We set up a time for him to come over and spend some time with his son. We met, you know, introduced ourselves to somebody new. So I'm going to say it was chilling like it was a friendly, you know, we're going to do something like friendly. So let's say lunch is a great time to make some friends. Who wants to be besties? Oh, and we're going to post about finals. Like we're a little nervous, but we feeling a little confident. So it's a finals can't take me down, crushed it. Girl, not too fast though. We got one more final to go. 
and we we gotta figure out our differences with one one more sim and i feel like that that um fear of being judged is probably gonna go away all right so we got 17 minutes i'm gonna be adding some more um classes like I mean, not classes, more clubs, because we already got the, I think it's already like an arts club. I want, I want it to be like a music club. So, you know, so the students could start learning different skills before they age up and see what they're interested in and all that. The principal always walking around. She always trying to catch somebody skipping class and shit. He need to go to class. He don't want in the bathroom. He probably feeling the bears like shit. No, it was really embarrassing him today. What the hell happened to the yo? <laughs> we left for two seconds. Look at Chanel. I cannot like. What happened to Chanel body? I'm gonna have to go into um, cast and come back because I cannot take that glitch. Yo, I really hate that freaking glitch. Like, <laughs> I had to go out of game and come back in just to, for her to get her freaking body back and the teacher. And then made cash switch seats. Like, now we sitting next to um, Scotty, her crush. Like, what the hell? And what is Munir doing? But we only got about 40 minutes left for this exam. So, hopefully... um. We finish off strong. I know I keep saying that, but I just need for Chanel. Because we only, honestly, this is her last year. I mean, you know, her last year. And school is over before the summer. So, cash graduation is actually the, the Friday before, the, the last Friday before the summer. So, I know Chanel, if I, I mean, if she, if Cash is graduating that day, I feel like all the seniors are going to be graduating that Friday. So, this is going to be Chanel's graduation as well. So, we only got about like two months left. Yeah, we got about a good, wait, two, three, six. We got about six weeks left. So, yeah, before the um the end of this year. Chanel, no, just take the exam, girl. Like, what are you doing? And Munir, you need to be taking your exam, too. Just sitting there looking stupid. So, she's feeling very inspired right now. What exam are we taking? I think it's an exam about everything, to be honest. <laughs> I'm, not too really, I'm not really too sure, like, how that goes. I want to get another one of them pop-ups. I like them. Child. I don't know why Munir acting like that. He really care a lot about his studies, so... Maybe he already, you know, finished it and it's just like... What? I hope this boy not coming over here and asks no dumb shit again. Y'all, what is wrong with him? Like, get out my face, bro. Uh, the hell? <laughs> Yo, he didn't ask us to be his best friend when we first came. Didn't ask us to prime. Now he asked us to be his best friend again. Like, child, let me find out Chanel got this. He got, she got a crush. Like somebody crushing on her. Real bad. So we got about five more minutes. I'm hoping that this actually boosts up her grade at least because I'm... This F is not look this F is not looking too good, y'all. Alright, so we did everything. Okay. So Oh wait, so it say, are you ready to start this stay over now? This will end any current running events. And Chanel Gray, it's a it's a grades are going up. Chanel has been working hard and is now a high school D student. Great job. So, I mean, we getting up there, y'all. So we just going to return home and begin stay over. Is we about to go? Are you not going home? Well, I guess we just got to go home ourselves. So let's say exams are finally over. The day was rolling and the, the questions was fierce. But the day is finally done thanks to quick work of the Scanatron 
MK7, MK7, all the tests has been greeted and the results, the results are out. Here's how everyone did. Chanel aced her exams. Great job. I knew she would, y'all, because she's been studying her ass off. And it's a promise coming. The dance takes place on Saturday. But when do I got the prom marked on the calendar? Okay, so prom is actually one, two, four Saturdays from now. And that's when, like, the official prom is. So, yeah, we're not going to pay that no mind. So, cash is staying over um, until Sunday. That's what it say. So, we're about to just head home. And I'm going to just see y'all when we get there. Okay, y'all. So, we're finally back home to this face. This adorable little face, y'all. I'm so excited. Like... I got so excited in the first part that I completely forgot to tell y'all all about Sincere's traits. And, you know, um, he did get two, I think two more, he did complete two more milestones. Like one, it was in game and I forgot to mention it. We had to um, Chanel's mom house for her housewarming party. Um, Sincere did get a milestone for that. But y'all, like... The Sims really did that. They they really did. They they they. I can't even get it out. <laughs> That's how excited I am. But they really did they big one with this y'all for real for real. Like like I swear the babies was so fucking boring that it was just like I had the baby set to like a person would give birth and they would not even they wouldn't even have the babies for one day. Like it would be like all right two hours go by. They we gonna feed and make sure they diapers. They diapers um change and then we gonna age them right on up because it was just like I was so hyped to get the toddlers and I was like I feel like the infant stage this is going I don't know how long I, I don't even I don't even know if I want to age up the infants to the toddlers like I don't know how long I'm gonna keep them infants but it's gonna be some time y'all like it's gonna be some time but anyways <laughs> look at adorable sincere um I wanted to actually tell y'all some of his traits stuff like that that i forgot to tell y'all so sincere is sensitive y'all sincere is say these sims are prone to diaper rash let me actually have the game playing because cash is actually over here he did um he did meet us here and he's about to be taking care of sincere for the weekend and stuff like that but it's say these sims are prone to diaper rashes are pro are often picky with food what are you about to do about to do oh you about to feed sincere a bottle he was hungry so um they can they can more easily become overstimulated by too much play in social interactions however however they also rest more peacefully through the night when soothed sincere loves wake up time y'all these it's a this infant is often bright and sunny upon awakening infants with this quirk are more likely to be happy when they wake up and it's a early risers this infant prefers to rise with the sun infant with this quirk are likely to wake up with when, when the sun comes up and he got the freak, frequently sneezes um trait so well quirk they say this infant is always sneezing infants with this quirk clear their little noses of particles and germs more frequently it's perfectly normal and healthy so um he got he actually yeah so he got a couple a couple different milestones so y'all already know he got the first diaper blew out y'all seen that in the first episode so he did get the first visit to a family member's house so it's a sincere went on a trip to visit his relatives so last night um when i when i had ended the episode and stuff like that and i put sincere to sleep he actually did, he, he got this milestone where he slept through the night so it's a all the sweet sound of silence those living, those living with sincere Yuma will never forget the first time he he finally slept a full rest without interruption. And um, he had his first visitor, but I'm trying to see was it something? Else? I think it was just these these two. That's the only one. So I'm gonna try to like make sure that. I tell y'all, you know, when he reached certain milestones. So, we just letting Cash do his thing. Like, he over here. Where you about to go? Oh, he got... Oh, he still got to go to football uh, practice. Oh, that's cool. He's still over here for the weekend. So, hey. Hey, Sincere. Let me come over here and play with Sincere. I've been missing you all day. Been missing my big boy all day oh look at him 
He is so adorable, y'all. Chanel really do. This is the best part of her day. The best part of coming home from school. To come home to his adorable face. And she finished off the day strong, too. Like, as far as school. Because now we're the student. So, wait, what to say? I don't got nothing really... I don't got no information about that, but what is I? It say, hey, I was thinking about checking out the city today. Can I use your place to get ready? I guess. I mean, she got a key. That's Megan. <laughs> but we over here just playing with Sincere. She still want to level up in her handiness skill. And she it's a look at the bright side. It's so bright, it's almost blinding. How does she do that? Because she is a cheerful sim. She always looking on the bright side of things. It's a go for a walk. A cold ass day. But I want to try to like do... She okay? Oh, I thought he was crying, y'all. They just be walking in anytime they want. Like They both got a key, Rhea and uh, Megan. So they do come over and like, you know, help Chanel out. When um when they can and stuff like that, but I want I actually want wait somebody calling Chanel. They say hey honey it's dead. When are you going to come visit? I put all my y'all. He is one to talk. It say I put all my love and effort into raising you. You can at least drop by once in a while and tell your dad you love him. Y'all we just we just start like being on speaking terms with you like at the housewoman party. Now you now you you just took it too far. Like you just doing too much. It's gonna be, we gonna be like, um, I can, but it was nice talking to you. It's a sigh. I understand you're you're busy, successful young lady. Now I guess my girl grew up to be just like me. I miss you though. I'm sorry, y'all got a message. It's a I miss you though. I'll always be here if you need me. Okay. Oh, he really is trying, but it's just like you didn't put all that effort and time into raising me though. So I don't know what you're talking about. Who's these people just wait? Who is this? Yo, like I don't know who this is why this is exactly why I don't like living in the apartments and I hate that they just come up randomly, you know, come up randomly to you and ask you do you want to be best friends, do you wanna go to prom, like get out. We gotta we really gotta save up for a place and I was actually looking at the new world and I feel it's it's like a a starter like a starter house that I feel like Chanel she she really can save up some money to move into that house so we 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 gonna definitely look into that because I'm def I'm over I'm really over the apartments now but let me invite I want her to invite over Jamila because I want Jamila and Sincere to meet I know she a little older than Sincere but. I think that would be cute to have them. Look, they'd be so excited to see each other. Like, y'all don't live right across from each other. I'm like, girl, invite your uh, daughter over so she can meet Sincere. You okay? Don't you crawl here. Can you get out of there by yourself? I wish they can get out of there by themselves, but I guess it's like a safeguard so they can stay in one spot. So let's say Jamila will be right over. Won't you um pull some of your toys out? Won't you play with your toy? So let me come over here and have some girl talk. I'm she getting a little hungry. Oh, she wanna practice standing with sincere. I didn't even think of this. What the hell? Y'all, not this boy following us. Oh, hell no. What the hell? Uh-uh, he is tripping. I'm about to make their relationship. I'm about to make it negative 50. Like, he is a weirdo. Get the fuck out of here, yo. There's really too much going on. Like, so, wait. It's her mom calling, y'all. It says, so I found a ring in Zaire's bag. I think he's going to propose to me. I don't know what to do. What should I say? Yes, no. Like, honestly, Chanel wouldn't say say yes. She probably would probably be like, 
you should really decide for yourself. Like, that's your decision, mom. You made a decision to get in a relationship with him again and have a baby. You, like, you don't need my, you don't need my uh, help. So you just decide on your own. So let's say, what do you want? Wait, I wanted her to practice the practice standing thing. How you do that? How's she about to do that? Oh my gosh, like it's a like, uh, tummy time together. I want to do the practice of standing. Okay, here we go. I'm like, girl. But her mom say, what do you, what do I want? I don't know what I want. I want a, you to decide for me. It's obvious I can't count on you for huge and impactful life decisions that really doesn't, that really, wait, what? That, that don't really concern you. Think, yeah, don't concern me. Like, you make, you grown. The hell? And I'm, y'all, I'm so annoyed with these damn apartments. Like, listen, don't be surprised if by the next episode, Chanel, it'll be like Chanel's moving into her new house because this is ridiculous. But we practicing standing with Sincere. She was practicing standing with Sincere. Oh, wait, I want Sincere to meet Jamila. Let's um, smile. Let me have him smile at Jamila. Can you take him out of there? Oh, I think he's smiling at her. Oh. I want you to take him out of there. Get carried. We're all here. What are they doing? Oh, she talking to him. Oh, she talking to him. Wait. They having a, having a bad conversation. But I want him to get out of there so he can, like, crawl to her and, like, see what he can do with another Tyler because he don't really, he don't be around Tyler's. So won't you uh smile at her? No, freaking put him down. No, don't put him. Why do you keep putting him right there? Uh -huh. Irking me. Just smile at Jam yo. Why everybody keep walking in here? You know what? All right. Let me see. Cause cash is big. Are right, we going force? Megan, you said you was only staying here to, you know, to kill some more time to get ready to go out to the city. So you need to leave. Javon need to leave. Rhea's over here with her daughter, so. And then somebody broke our refrigerator. It's just too much going on. You okay? I wanted you to talk to Jamila. Won't you smile at her? That's all he can do to that's all he can do with her? Well he can bear boo. You bear boo with Jamila. Wait, you taking her? Oh, she's taking her home. Oh man. I guess y'all. She like, all right, we gonna go. Your man here. You need to go too, bro. I don't know why you still here. I'm like, listen, your day father's dear. We gonna um let y'all have some, you know, let y'all have some space. But Javon just be thinking that he just could come over here whenever he want. Like I swear, he be barging in all the time. But I'm gonna force him to go. Javon, can you go? Like, we real cool with him, but he just like too invasive. Oh, there go Jamila right there. She didn't walk back across the hall, y'all. I don't have the ask to up, you know, ask to repair stuff. Chanel do want to, um, she do want to level up her handiness skill. I don't know if this is the best time to be doing it, like, trying to repair her own refrigerator. But we're going, we're going to try it. We're going to try it. So what you doing over here, Sincere? Oh, he want to try to go to sleep. Turn the radio off. And put his own self to bed, y'all. And he got to go to sleep. I mean, and he, and he gotta go, I'm going to have him use his diaper. 
I know that was gonna wake him up. I thought he can do that in his sleep. You call for your dad. Don't you um? Don't you ask for help? Yes, put him to work. I know we can actually ask him, like, since he, since he, he, he left out, like, real quick. I want to ask him to help out while he is over here. You know, please don't electrocute yourself. I only got her doing this only because she want to level up her handiness skill. Because it says, if y'all be reading the whims, it says Chanel will always be known for being clumsy, but maybe a little... Hand, hand eye coordination can help stop her from stumbling so much. So, oh, he put him in his crib. Oh, he put him to sleep real quick, y'all. Yeah, it's just actually, um, getting in the hang of getting the hang of being a day. Like, you make it look so simple. I really do love when they flip over and stuff, that's so adorable. Almost get we almost done um fixing a refrigerator. Oh oh y'all she got electrocuted. Oh my gosh, I knew she's gonna get electrocuted. We gonna have to ask Cash to fix it. Like we tried. We tried. So we did ask him to help out while he is here. But let's actually like have like a deep conversation. All these freaking glasses around. I'm like, hey, I appreciate you really trying. You really, um, you know, you really doing what you said you was going to do. You coming over here, spending time with your son, and, you know, making the best effort or whatever. I do appreciate that. So, I definitely want to, um, I want to have her apologize just for, like, being so hard on him and stuff like that. Because he wasn't around for a minute, but he is trying his best. So we just going to apologize for... Just for just for the past, like... The past arguments, just our past relationship that we, you know... All the little shit that we was going through and shit like that. Because now it's just like we got a child now. And we got to do what's best for our child. So let's share baby pictures. Uh -huh. I think it's a picture I want to give Cash... Yeah, I want to give Cash these pictures. So we sharing some baby pictures that we took. And some that he can have for himself. How do we... Alright, let's give a gift. Let's give a friendly gift. Give him that. I might have to control Cash just so he can fix our refrigerator. I hear it was, there's some pictures I took of you and um sincere. Give them to your mom, or you keep them. You gonna give him another one? The one of him sleeping. I took I took a picture of um sincere sleeping like a creep, y'all. I don't know if I showed y'all, but <laughs> and I put the picture of I put the picture up of Chanel's sister. They both sleeping, so cute. Oh, we definitely got to package them, the lingerie to send them off because we need them before Sunday. So we got to send them off by tonight or like at least steam them and stuff. Oh, wait, what he doing? Hear about Cash's greed. So I feel like Cash passes um, his, his exam today too. So he bragging about that. But I'm going to actually control Cash and... Oh, I can't. I forgot when they stay over, you can't, um, can't control them and, like, do stuff with them. Like, that's the only downside about, you know, about that stay over thing. You can't control them to do stuff. So, I'm going to just hire a repair service. Or maybe he'll just do it. I feel like maybe, because he got a real high handy to skill. Maybe he'll just do it on his own. But in the meantime, I'm going to just clean up. Let's clean everything up. Going. Clean this up. There's a lot of, there's a lot of um, cups around. 
What's this? Oh, let's throw that away. Can he help clean up? Like, you just standing around. Did I even ask him to help out? Oh, yeah, I did. So it's like Cash was already recently asked. Okay, so, oh, like, okay, I see you. Taking out the trash. Or so maybe we ain't got to do as much. He probably just could do it himself. But, um... We need to steam these lingerie, you know, these lingerie, um, wait, what? We need to steam the the lingerie that's for the, um, the strip club. Girl. Butterfingers? So, basically, we have to, let me see how I do this. Steam clothes. All right, so we can know what type of fabric it is from, like, if I go to Steam Clothes, it tell me, like, all the different type of fabric. Like, this one is satin, this one is cotton, like, stuff like that. And then we just got to go to the ironing board and set the temperature to whatever it was. So, all right, so for instance, I'm going to do the Wonder Sexy Lingerie. So, that's a satin ribbon or whatever. So, I'm going to have to set the temperature. That's for cotton and linen. I need something for satin. So 136 to 150 Celsius is for satin. Okay, he actually, oh, I think he fixed the refrigerator. I know that's right, Cash. That's what's up. Like, he really is helping out. Can you clean the sink for me, too? I really appreciate that. So, let's iron. Oh, wait. Gotta put them in her story. Well, I think it was the one. Was it this one? Y'all didn't forgot that damn fizz. Wait, can I not iron it? Or we just gotta steam it? Okay, so we just gotta steam it. So let me steam the Wonder Sexy Lingerie. I don't know if you, I don't know if it's the steaming or is the iron one that we actually like a package it after that. I'm gonna see what the, I'm gonna see what this one do. So we gotta get back to making this money, and y'all, it's looking like chanel about to be moving out of this apartment soon because i can't take it all these people just constantly walking in and it's just like no type of privacy here we got this door locked because we be needing privacy when we working what he and her doing oh he making the cake or something i'm just happy that he over here that he just helping out he just you know he here that he here when we need him Oh, let me keep my eye on Sincere. So, as y'all know, tomorrow is um the family gathering slash family reunion. And I'm not going to be playing from Chanel's point of view. I will be playing from um my new Let's Play point of view. So, um yeah, I just wanted to make that known because Chanel will be at the family reunion, but we won't be, like, playing with her. She would just be, like, be in the background. So, yeah, that's that's going to be tomorrow. So, I'm definitely excited about that. Chanel did give us some thoughts. She like, listen, my dad's trying to make the effort. I know he wasn't around for, you know, that many years. This is her her inside thoughts. Like, he don't know what she's thinking. But she's like, listen, I'm going to try to, like, make the best effort to, like, why not? I always wanted my dad in my life. I was always wondering about him. Now he's here, and why am I being so mean? So she's going to try to, like, put her best foot forward and just make make the best out of it. Make the most out of it, you know? But she got way more family than she thought or that she knows. So it's like, why not? Why why go there and be the sour puss? Well, he made a cake. Made a white cake. <laughs> So I think I think this make it um I think let me speed it up a little bit. So let's say a lot of Twitter Twitter worthy things happen to Chanel today. Where it goes, Chanel? When? Where you put it at? So I think it was this one that we did.
Oh wait, they flirting over there? I see y'all. Over there flirting and stuff. But I'm gonna let them do what they do. Asking her something. Yo, look, they 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 uh romance went up a little bit and he's feeling very very flirty, but it's an awkward encounter. I'ma just let them do their own thing. Don't don't go to bed yet, Chanel, because we need to be up doing some work. Oh, so we can pack it now. So when we steam it, we can pack it. All right, so we steamed that one. Wait, what's she about to do? She about to compliment his appearance. I told y'all the love is still there, like, but she's too tired to, like, follow through with it. But I'm going to have her come over here and pack this up. Is it any more? Where does steamer go? Oh. like this all right so we got one packaged up i don't know why the hell is that can wear we got one box packaged up it's right there just got to get the other one so let me steam the me outfit i think this is better probably because we ain't got to keep setting the temperatures and all that yeah, so we only got to iron, like, the clothes. I think the lingerie, we just got to steam it. We're going to steam all of them. He's pack them, package them up for the night. Cash is really, he really doing, he really doing the damn thing, like. Oh, not him smoking, too. You know what? Listen, I take, <laughs> I take it. He didn't clean, he didn't clean majority of the whole apartment. He can have his little smoke break. And this is another thing, y'all, because last time when they was, like, fighting and arguing, they actually woke up sincere. So I'm hoping that this don't wake up sincere. It did. Oh, my God. Oh, my Lord. Can you call for your dad? Can you call help? Hopefully he hear him over there smoking. I mean, he not crying or nothing. He just angry. It's a noisy neighbor. See, this is another thing. Like, I hate this. Oh, you getting a little fussy? He fussing. He hungry though. Won't you get fed? Let me see if Cash is gonna do it automatic. Cash, she over here fussing. What's going on? Oh, I love to see it. Yes. Oh yeah, y'all. He just he didn't did it without without even um being told. I love this so much. Like I remember when it was a hard time for Cash to even like do more than two things with Sincere. It was just like, alright, well, I had enough. Like that's how much he didn't want his son. Like that's crazy. Now it's looking like he doing shit without us even asking. I'm so excited. This is why a kid need both of their parents in their life, especially they did. Especially their mom, but I feel like when it's the son, they especially need their dad to teach them how to be a man and stuff like that. Because it's stuff that a woman can teach their son. Well, her son. Okay. Don't come back in here, Chanel. So. We pack it. Let's pack that one up. Going steam. We got. We gonna steam the dragon lingerie. I think this is better than iron the clothes. Oh, look at them in there just playing. So cute. Ooh, he bit him. Oh shit. He bit cash. <laughs> Listen, that's your son. I'm cracking up. Like he is so angry. I need your diaper change. Oh, you smiling at your dad? Won't you smile at kids? Show your dad you, you learn how to smile. Because he wasn't around for a, a lot of shit. Look, he, look at him. He's smiling. He's too fussy right now, no. Um, won't you bad, boo?
She's so smoky, Cash. She's like Cash is smoking. We just in here doing the damn thing. How you feeling, Chanel? It's a ooh from steaming clothes. Look at that flow. The clothes look sharp enough to pack, package and wear. I know that's right, girl. Noisy neighbor. They still over there love making. We ain't even going to be hating and try to like go interrupt them. They can do the. They can do they. They can do they um do their thing. And she's feeling a little tired. Um, need a, she need amusement and busted by um busted by dust. Gotta get her her, her allergy pill. She already got them. Take her allergy pills. We need a um a vacuum cleaner or something. Girl, not you coming here. You better go home. What the hell? Coming back here. You said you wanted to use the apartment just to get ready, not to be staying here all damn night. Tripping. We got a whole toddler over here. And our baby father. We got two of them packaged. We got to package these, this one and these two. And that's 2000 a piece, y'all, right there. Like, you got to make this money. Because if I'm not mistaken, the um the house that I do, that I, I'm interested in Chanel getting, that's in the new world, Um, I think it's like 20000 Let's package. Let's pick that. <laughs> Yeah, I think it's like twenty thousand. You getting a little tired too. Imagine here just holding his son like. Did you still smoking? Yo, that's why Cash was freaking. Um, he just sitting here. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, he just sitting here smoking with Cecilia in his hand. Like Cash, you gotta do better. I'm over here like he's such a good father. He up there blowing O's out his mouth. Get get put back to bed by Cage. Like, like Dad, I wanna go back in my in my crib. You don't want all that smoke in his freaking face. Look, look at Cash eyes all. That's how you know he was smoking. Eyes all freaking big and wide. I can't. This this what you get with teen parents. Like, they're not perfect. They do try their best though. Give him a little kiss. Tummy time. Oh, we're going to put him to sleep. Child, we didn't see that though, so we don't know what's going on. But I promise y'all, we would have seen that shit. We would have been right up. We would have been right, right at cash. I'm going to have her steam one more outfit. one more outfit and then try to like care for herself a little because we ain't we're not gonna go to bed you know just yet trying to get her to get some stuff like situated got three of them we're gonna send them off too probably tomorrow morning send them off first thing in the morning you going back to sleep he going back to sleep they all, they all done over there. Should I get, I need to get Cash a um, bed because I don't think that he's going to be sleeping in the bed with us. So I might have to get him like an air mattress. Or I don't know. I'm going to see. We're going to see because mind you, their relationship, they romance did go up a little bit. So we're going to see. If he want to sleep in the bed with us, I mean, he still got the couch, but if push come to shove, we're going to get him a ear mattress or whatever. But Chanel about to pass out soon, and she need a little excitement, like, mm -hmm. it's like, no, let me not. <laughs> we are not about to be messy and, you know, get ourselves into no shit that we ain't try to, you know, we ain't, we ain't prepared for right now because we are already a mother of one. So adorable, y'all. Like, this is definitely, this would definitely give you baby fever. So adorable. And Cash is sitting there just watching them, like, being so protective over him. All right, so this is the last one we're going to do because she about to pass out. Maybe we can play some games with Cash. Look at that. 
Where did the thing go? Girl, what you do with the... Oh, she just stink one. Child, I don't know what the hell she just did with that one, y'all. It didn't disappear. But let's, um, let's watch a movie. Watch College Cram with kids. Probably pass out in the middle of this movie, but mm -hmm. I ain't trying to go to bed all fast. Maybe we can like have some small, you know, have a little conversation too. Like, let's ask about no, let's let's um let's gossip. Yeah. <laughs> Look, he over there feeling flirty too. Yeah, she ain't got time to be gossiping. Let's say flirtation. She feeling a little flirty. Maybe we can... Let's ask if he's single. Let's see. Let's see if he's single. And... Let's see what he said. So we'll say Chanel has learned that Cashmere is single. Okay. That's nice to know. She feeling a little tense, though. It say I'm bad at this. She need amusement. Say something. What what will Chanel say? Pineapple? No, just say hi. So she still feeling like like butterflies around cash still to this day when she had his baby. I don't get it, but what else? Um uncomfortable near crush and it say bling flown vision. Oh, she gotta make it she gotta definitely um schedule an exam for her eyes. But this is bringing her amusement up a little bit. I'm just letting them watch a little movie, have a little conversation. And I feel like this is just like opening up a door where though they can co-parent, you know, co-parent a little bit more better or whatever. She cracking up y'all like <laughs> I'm dead. But I think I'm about to end this part right here only because I got to prepare for the family reunion and stuff like that. So, um, definitely give me a thumbs up and a sweet comment below and hit that subscribe button if you're new and definitely don't forget to hit that post notification bell so you don't miss the next, you don't miss the next time I post a video. Um, definitely, um, let me know how y'all like this episode and I'll see y'all in the next episode. Bye guys. Put a little wall around, niggas take the door off, trap them in the swimming pool.